Hello. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. We are very lucky. We are very lucky to celebrate our hundred. I would to um, on his hundred birth anniversary. Uh, Bangladesh Ashami, the Bangladesh chapter is uh, going to celebrate with the international faculties. I welcome everybody. Uh, our chairperson of this anniversary is uh, Honor Professor Mopakharul Bari. And the keynote speaker is our President Bangladesh Orthopedic Society, Director Nitor, and Secretary General of Ashami Bangladesh Chapter, Professor Abdul Ghani Molla, is on the dais. And the peoples who take fellowship from Kurgan is here. Especially the foreign faculties, Jin Chang Jung, Professor Nobikov, Professor Harshad, or one of the close friends. Professor Gamal, our teacher of the teacher, Professor Shamsuddin Ahmed, our teacher, Professor Khandakar Abdullah Rizvi, our mentor, Professor Amdev Rahum Koiri, and our proud Professor M. Amjad Hussain sir is here. I, Professor Wahidur Rahman, the Secretary General of Bangladesh Orthopedic Society, is welcoming everybody in this anniversary and this occasion. I will request our two junior colleagues, Dr. Nazmul Kudashetu and Dr. Anvir Ashraf to conduct the session with these few words. Hopefully, I hope this session will be very much glorious, educative, as well as fantastic. After a long time, it is our auto during this pandemic situation. We are not traveling abroad. If it would be possible, then at least Professor Bari would be in Kurgan. With these few words, I requesting Najmul Dashetu and Dr. Tanvir Ashraf, please continue the program with the CL person, Professor Mabakarul Bari, and keynote personnel, Professor Goni Mulla, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you, everybody. <coughs> Hello, Malikum, and very good morning to everybody. This is a great pleasure and great honor for us it's because of we're going to celebrate the 100 years celebration of the legendary orthopedic surgeon, uh, Gabriel Abramovich Lizarov. Is the man behind millions of smile, behind millions of recovery. He is the magician of the magician. From Nitor, we show our respect. From Asami Bangladesh, we give salute to the legendary orthopedic surgeon. Dear viewers, I would like to thank our Secretary General of Bangladesh Orthopedic Society. Professor Dr. Wahidur Rahman, sir, for giving me a scope to conduct this session. Now, I would like to request a very prestigious person, that is Professor Abdul Ghani Mulla, sir, the President of Bangladesh Orthopedic Society, the Secretary of Asami, and the present successful director of NITOR. I would like to request Professor Abdul Ghani Mullah, sir, for his welcome address. Professor Abdul Ghani Mullah, sir. Bismillah rahman rahim Today is the 100-year birth anniversary of Gabriel Elijarab. We are celebrating Ashami International Bangladesh chapter, celebrating this program in Nitwar. 
with the collaboration of Bangladesh Orthopedic Society and the National Institute of Traumatology and Orthopedic Rehabilitation. We are in this prestigious occasion. We are very much grateful and very much happy to see the international faculty of Elizabeth in the world, like Professor Obakar Lubari, he is our president of the Asham International Bangladesh chapter, and the, our grand teacher, the teacher of the teacher, great orthopedic surgeon in Bangladesh, right. Professor Samsuddin Sir is here, ex president of Bangladesh Orthopedic Society, Professor Amjadoshan. Professor Khandukar Abdullah Al is here. Okay. Professor Ramdavram Khairi is here. And the international faculty, our great teacher, Professor Nobikov from Kurgan, Professor Cheng from Beijing, Professor Harshad from Bangalore, India, Dr. Samsuluda from Bihar, India, and other international faculties are here. The Elizabeth of the great man is the, the teacher, the great academician. He invented a, a method of orthopedic practice. It is the great, we are, uh, we, we bless our gratitude and our wholehearted the respect and honor to that great person. We are lucky that we are able to celebrate his birthday anniversary, 100 year birthday anniversary. The man is no more in the world, but his activities, his discovery, his invention, Elizabeth, is all over the world. And the patient, those who are benefited by, the, by this method, the fantastic method, where there is no solution, the solution is Elizabeth. So the Elizabeth, in the name of the great magician and great academician, G. A. Elizabeth is favorable all over the world. So in this occasion, I don't want to extend my space. I welcome everybody to this great occasion. And um, again, I give my gratitude and respect to the senior teachers, those who are coming from the home and abroad. So I, with this few words, I conclude my speech here. Thank you very much for your passion hearing. Thank you very much. Thank you. Professor Abdul Ghani Mullah, sir, for your excellent welcome address. Now, I would like to request the legendary Elizabeth surgeon and the pioneer Elizabeth surgeon in Bangladesh, who will spread the love of Elizabeth in Bangladesh. That is Professor Mofak Karul Bari, sir, the president of Asami Bangladesh chapter. I would like to request Professor Mofak Karul Bari, sir, to say something regarding the biography of the Elizarov, Professor Mofakarul Barisar, President Asami. Bismillahir Rahman Rahim. My dear, uh, all foreign faculties and our senior. Uh, Bangladeshi faculties and uh, today I'm very much lucky that uh, we are going to observe this 100 years birthday celebration of Professor Gabriel Abramovich Lizarov and today I would like to share my experience with the history and some of the cases that we are doing in our country with this Lizarov technique. That's right. Very good. 
Okay. These are the places. Okay. These are the places that I have taken my training. And these are the, I must say, my two institutions where I did my PhD and uh, MS, Tashkent and in the, uh, Kiev. And this is the automatic capital. And this is our institute that I worked more than 10 years here. This is the thousand bedded hospital. And here are the faculties you can see. And this is now I am uh, for the current time, I'm working these two hospitals in Baden, biggest hospital in Southeast Asia and Bangladesh Institute of Health Science. This is my center. This is Kurgan. This is Professor Elizar of 4M. You can see man, meat, method and magician. And location of the Kurgan, you can see 3000 kilometers from the Moscow. So Elizar of Method has established itself as a powerful technology for the management of a great variety of bone diseases and conditions. It is considered by us as a system that is based on biological laws and the technological philosophy. We must know this tension stress effect that is stimulates the biosynthetic activities in tissues. We must know the adequacy of blood supply. Gradual lengthening and correction, this is the fundamental principle of Elizabeth methodology. And possibility of full-time control, we can see the callus formation. Of course, the early limb functioning and loading is very important in this Elizabeth technique. So, here. magician of the Kurgan, you can see it's Gabriel Abramovich born in 1921, 6th June, uh, 15th June in 1921 and passed away. In 1992, 27th July. He graduated in 1944 and he invented his transocious osteosynthesis in 1952. In 1968, he did his PhD regarding his thesis and on the same meeting, they, they conferred him the DSC Doctor of Science and which has conferred him in 1969. In 1970, there was a symposium and you can see here the picture of the Fidel Castro. In 1976, all Soviet conference was held where he demonstrated theoretical and practical aspects of transocious osteosynthesis. You can see the Professor Elizarov talking with the, with the patient. You can see, just look at this picture. There's no leg below. How to go for lengthening of the amputated lip. Professor himself, academician himself, He's just describing, this is, he's talking in Russian, that's why I vomited that one in Russian language. You can see how his smiling face, this is occurring in 1990, and he died in 1992. <laughs> 84, there was a conference in Italy, and Asami was formed in 1985. Look at this, he lived for 17 years, worked for 40 years for his method, and he worked in Kurgan in 21 years. So this is with Professor Shivsu and Dror Pele. So 1992, he published a book that was the 8,000 cases in English and 656 pictures with 3,100 illustrations. And these are the foreign uh, awards he got. And when uh, he was well known because of treating the Carlo Mauri, the Italian patient. And this is the family of Professor Gabriel Abramovich Elizarov, uh, Sivitlana, his daughter, and the right side, I was just, just uh, uh, smiling with that fellow, the son of Professor Elizarov, Alexander. During and this is Italian trouble, this, you can see here. Carl Mauro, a member of the world team of the four higher expedition, had constant pain in the head and leg, and was taken to after an accident in the So, this is so extraordinary theory and principles he developed for the treatment of bones are of even greater significance than his instrumentation and devices. <clears throat> you can see his first model of Elizarov external fixator. So, what are the contributions of Elizarov? Very important four things are. First, biologic law, and second one is a method of corticotomy, how to do the corticotomy. By doing corticotomy, you can lengthen whatever you like. And destruction, compression, osteogenesis, 
neurogenesis, myogenesis, histogenesis, tissue genesis, and of course, the myriads of instruments, the thousands of instruments. So the procedure and the first apparatus designed by Elizarov, the, you can see a shaft bow harness on a horse carriage. Originally, bicycle parts were used for the same frame. Now you see how he taught bamboo. He, he took a wooden stick and he tried himself how to pass the wires. And this is in 1950. You can see at that time, 1950, how many years back? You can see this is doing his passing. This is the Elizabeth of himself. He's doing this kind of, you know, bone model, not bone model, wooden model. Okay, this is his first apparatus. And this is the car which is situated in front of the museum of the Elizabeth Center. So now this is the 850 beds hospital, 18 departments, 24 operation theaters, more than 350 orthopedic surgeons, and 1,500 nurses, therapies, and ancillary personnel. So this is the center, so beautifully decorated. And I must say, in 2011, 44 orthopedic surgeons from our country visited this hospital, including the most senior orthopedic surgeon, Professor Shamsuddin Sat. And this is in, you know, winter snowfall, you can see in summer. Now this situation in summer, and this is the front gate of the Elizabeth Center. This is the museum. This is the Elizabeth Museum. The doctors and scientists of the Russian Ilizarov Scientific Center for Restorative Traumatology and Orthopedics have given back the joy of life to thousands of patients, brought fame to national medicine and honor to our state. This is Professor Katadny, who introduced Elizarov in Italy first, after the Soviet Union. And then see, uh, I myself would draw Pele, with Professor Chi from China, and uh, uh, other faculties from the Western world in the left side. This is, we conducted several times Elizarov conference in our country. Professor V.I. Shepsov, he's the disciple and successor of Elizarov came eight times to Dhaka. And you can see here, Professor Shepsov and Professor uh, Gabriel Abramovich Elizarov, when they were flying, they are going from Moscow to Kurgan. And this boat, this genius orthopedic surgeon, you can see here. So these are the uh, different situations. This is the now new director. This is the animal center in Kurgan, and this is the magician of Kurgan. You can see, you can correct the vertebrology for managing severe spinal deformities, such as scoliosis of second to fourth grade, kyphosis, spondylolisthesis, acute and neglected lateral trauma, including the one complicated the spinal cord injury. So you can see the animal. In the cats, you can see how they put the, the dog. This is the animal center. So method reserve is not hard to learn, but it takes take proper knowledge, effort, devotion, patience, practice, intelligent, meticulous follow-up, and basic understanding of kinesiology, kinematics, anatomy, physiology are mandatory before attempting to master this technique. Today, we have gained a very strong foothold in Bangladesh, and we can demand for that. And uh, this is in 2000, 2013. Uh, they, have, they have made me a distinguished professor of that center, 2000, June 2013. So this is my student life. When I was working in Kurgan Elizarov Center, these are the situations. I would like to proceed faster. So this is, you know, all American giants left side with Kinsey stalwarts of Elizabeth technique. This was in Brisbane, all stalwarts from all over the country. And today we're going to observe the 15th Elizabeth, 15 June, the Elizabeth, World Elizabeth Day. 
and in my country we were doing. Now I'd like to touch something regarding the deformity condition of the reserve. Pre-reserve era, you can see there was no, no normal situation at that time, no satisfactory treatment. All the time they are doing nothing, prosthetic fitting or amputation. But in 1950, Elizabeth popularized the principles of gradual destruction of osteogenesis, law of tension stress. There was no deformity that could not be addressed with Elizabeth's circular frame and biological principle of destruction of osteogenesis. Dear friends, I would like to draw your attention regarding this. If you think about the orthopedic and traumatology, it is our fixator and its biological principles of gradual destruction revolutionized the management of limb deformities. Look at this limb length discrepancy, any bone and joint deformities, soft tissue contractures, bone loss, delayed and non unions, infections, transverse destruction, and of course, you can solve the problems with the ischemic limbs. So now let us see the Elizarov legacy. Three things. Elizarov fixator, circular fixator, principles of destruction of osteogenesis, you can see here, and newly formed degenerate bone. Unique in vivo tissue engineering technique. No other available technique could form new bone. Unlimited quantities you can get. And same micro and macro structure as native bone. Of course, you'll get vascularized bone or tissue with simultaneous regeneration of all soft tissues. So you can see here, no other options except the lizard of this kind of deformities, LLD and deformities. See upper limb deformities, you can solve only with the lizard of. See the bone deformities, bone quality of the records, you can solve with only reserve technique. Other technique you can apply, but outcome will not be so excellent just like it is reserve. Same dwarf lengthening you can see here, and gradual correction of severe angular deformities you can see here, through soft tissue or through osteotomies. Post-traumatic tibial gap non-unions, look at the left side, big gap. So you can correct all these things, and community fracture, you can see, these are the cases that can, you can solve with this fantastic magical Elizarov technique. And what is Elizarov true legacy? Is not only the contributions is made about 70 years ago. Most important, colossal stimulus, I must say, huge stimulus, which was described Alexander Gubin, DDEC director of the Kurgan Center. That is his real legacy to reach new heights. Nothing is impossible today we can do. Anything, whatever we like. And what has Elizarov taught me? There is a solution for all kinds of bone and joint problems. The principles of all devices are the same. New or it not necessarily better. Attention to Elizarov wire or K wire is an amazing device to respect the vascular anatomy. Recording in Minimum progress. invasive surgery. Patient can talk next day after work, next day after the surgery. Load and motion is equal to your getting healing. So travel up, there is no path. The path is made by walking. Look at this. It is our magic, has no limits. Look at this. Director of the medical science, daughter. He traveled outside my country, and inside my country, everybody suggested him to go for a mutation. And what we have done, look at this. Look at this x-ray, before surgery, after surgery. And learning points, I'm going to finish now, dear friends. Elizarov was a giant in orthopedics. His principles of destruction of osteogenesis has revolutionized the management of limb deformities. His true legacy, however, is the continuous stimulation and inspiration that his contribution have on the medical and scientific community to study, discover, innovate new areas in the management of limb deformities to continue basic science and clinical research in the field of bone deformities and regeneration. And I must say, you are all orthopedic surgeons. If you have time, once in your life, try to visit the orthopedic capital. What kind of research what they are doing. And Elizabeth is the property of the whole world. 
not not the only for the orthopedic surgeons now the reserve surgery is using in urology in geriatric surgery you know in gynecology and the man who invented this apparatus and technique great scientist talented doctor gifted innovator creator of the apparatus the transosseous osteosynthesis the reserve shoulder and you will continue our effort the physician must observe nature learn from it and to be able to rectify its flaws so and i am very much happy and in my bangladesh uh, we are doing lot of cases and we can show our talent and we have got a lot of opportunities because we are 17 170 million people and its utility is unlimited and development of elizar of surgery we have done all these things and we are doing we are trying see see children in kurgan and in my country and dear friend finally i always love to show this slide carry home message what i have shown you this is the evidence what i talked on there that is the science and of course before to do something this is the surgical skill of the of the surgeon and in my country we are doing lot of cases i told you this is only based on biological and mechanical and we are happy that bangladesh has gained a very strong full hold on elizar of surgery excellence is not luck dear friend it is the result of a lot of hard work and practice hard work and practice make a person better at whatever he is doing there is magic wand for success success comes to doers not observers so thank you so much for your patient hearing recording stopped thank you professor mafa karol bari sir for your nice and magnificent presentation now i would like to request one of our national faculty who is the teacher of all teachers the legendary orthopedic surgeon in our country professor shamsuddin ahmed sir i would like to request the honorable professor shamsuddin ahmed sir to say something regarding the 100 year celebration of elizaro could you please connect professor shamsuddin ahmed sir assalam alaikum dear friends i am really pleased and thankful to be able to join this 100 years of birthday celebrations of professor g a elizaro organized by the assami bangladesh Professor Elijaro was born in Russia on 15/6/21 and passed away on 24/7/92. I pay tribute to this great scientist, academician, and orthopedic surgeon of 20th century. His powerful technique has revolutionized the management of a great variety of bone diseases and the conditions based on biological laws and technique and philosophy some of the examples are limb length deformities acquired or congenital leg length deformities and discrepancies bony and joint deformities bone loss delayed union non union ischemic limb post operative and post traumatic osteomyelitis with implants and stump lengthening congenital pseudoarthrosis of the tibia and so on and so on this above mentioned particularly this above mentioned conditions were really a problem and a difficult problem for us to treat 
really we deserve success by the other conventional methods in orthopedic surgery. We were really unhappy with the treatment of this surgery and it's a great salvage also for us by this <clears throat> method of a reserve treating particularly the above conditions. It, it, is, it has really rescued us, this, particularly this, uh, uh, this uh, uh, conventional methods before the advent of this uh, Elizarov technique. Professor Elizarov's invention has now indeed restored the joy of life to thousands of the patients around the world. Now I want to say something about the uh, Elizarov, position of the Elizarov in our country. I still remember that uh, this was really virtually unknown. Uh, the name of the Elizarov was virtually unknown to us before Professor Bari came back to Bangladesh from Russia, I think in the year 1986. Is it, Dr. Bari? And after being qualified and trained there, before that it was almost unknown to us. It is due to the loan effort of Professor Bari that the Elizabeth technique has now gained a strong foothold in Bangladesh. Many of the Bangladesh orthopedic surgeons has made brilliant and clinical or brilliant achievement on Elizaro and practicing it in different parts of the country with immense benefit to the patients. Professor Bari, who is also a honored professor of Elizaro Center, Purgan, Russia, where I visited along with him in the year 19. Uh, 2011, sorry. And I am now very much happy that Professor Bari is also is a stalwart, one of the stalwarts of this technique in the world. I pray to Almighty Allah, Subhanahu wa Taala, for his healthy, long, active life, along with his associates all over the world, so that. The combined knowledge, experience, and technique of this is being transferred to his disciples, who may again multiply it many folds for the service to the suffering humanity. I wish good wishes to everybody. Allah Hafiz. Thank you very much. Thank you, Professor Shamsuddin, sir. We pray to Almighty Allah that we can get you for a long time and for your long life. Thank you for your admirable speech. Dear viewers, now is the time for the international faculty who already joined with us. Now I'd like to request Professor Novikov, sir, from Kurgan, Russia, to say something about the Elizarov. From Kurgan, Russia, Professor Novikov, sir. Would you please connect Professor Novikov, sir? Good afternoon. Do you hear me? Yes, sir, Hello, we can hear you. Dear friends, you can hear me? Yes, sir, we can hear you. We can hear you clearly and loudly. Uh, once more, uh, thank you very much for your invitation and possibilities together celebrate and uh, we'll be together. Uh, this is magic day, day when beyond our teacher, our father, men who give us possibilities, who give us, for me, for example, every what I have in the life. And uh, Dr. Uh, Bari 
very good thought uh, about Elizarov, about his life. I want a little bit add. What is it, Elizarov methods? This is apparatus. This is methods. Elizarov, this is effect. Elizarov, this is center. In Kurgan, we have street with the name of Elizarov, airport. In the sky, when we see to the sky, we can see a planet with name. And for us, just now, I see uh, to the screen of my computer and uh, Elizarov give me possibilities, contact with so many great uh, surgeons from all of the world. For doctor, this is possibilities go away from all of difficulties what we have during the, our job. This is efficiency, uh, Elizarov, this is simplicity, reliability, and this is mini invasive surgery. For doctor, for situation, this is rigid fixation of bone fragment, early load on the operated limb. This is early function of adjustment joint and ability to manage bone fragments from moment of surgery till moment of removal frame. And for us, this is excellent situation we can during the treatment can contact with patient all period of treatment. And Elizarov methods allow the doctor to correct the all of errors and prevent complications. And I want to repeat a few words from very good doctor from Iran who spent last uh, 15 years only for Elizarov methods. Before, yes, he worked with different methods and now he, this is what from heart. I think this is any uh, doctor and all of us can repeat this. Elizarov feel any effect of life of the bone. When you are helpless in orthopedic treatment, think to Elizarov, extended the quality of life by Elizarov lengthening. When all light are off, the light of Elizarov is on. Surprising, unbelievable event by Elizarov. The end of disability by Elizarov. Bright future in disability by Elizarov. And dear friend, I want to congratulate all of us with uh, great data, with uh, this is, excellent possibilities when we can contact with each other. <clears throat> and I hope more and more data in the world will use our Russian international magic, fantastic methods. Thank you very much for your attention. And I invite you, all of you, come here to the Kurgan, and you will touch this magic iron, really. Thank you very much, dear friends. Thank you. Thank you, Professor Novikov, sir, from the city of Elizarov, that is Kurgan. Now, I would like to request one of our legendary professor, Professor Amjad Hussain, sir, Professor Amjad Hussain, sir, to say something regarding the Elizarov in Bangladesh. Professor Amjad Hussain, sir, would you please connect Professor Amjad Hussain, sir, with us? Thank you, <clears throat> Dr. Tanvir Ashraf. Welcome our guests, our friends from different countries, as well as uh, our national faculties. My teacher, Professor Shamsuddin Ahmed, the director of NITOR, uh, Professor Goni Mullah, and the chairman of the Asami, Professor Abdullah Mufakkarul Bari, 
actually who was the pioneer of every, uh, this sort of things started uh, in dhaka uh, basically this elizabeth hall which we are the 100 years of or his centenary we are celebrating today is really a, a very much a fantastic i mean uh, uh, for us it is a real really honor and we have been honored and putting honor to him also because such a man such a visionary person such a philosopher and unbelievable that what he was working in a, in a hidden place in soviet union the then soviet union in the city of kurgan what he have developed to me if you you would have been in other part of europe or in america he have been offered nobel laureate or he could have been a nobel winner but unfortunately as he was in behind the scenery and uh, he was in the soviet union even his his discoveries his what he has discovered what he has done for the human king this human being is not been discovered until 1991 when it was when he visited before uh, uh, in new york or one italian who has uh, i mean told about it and described about it let me say about in bangladesh <clears throat> uh this is the kurgan you see and uh, i'm really very much uh, i'm today i'm feel nostalgic because of i visited kurgan with my teacher and others professor bari and other our friends and but what has happened i see we when we were student in rasd these and rasd we haven't heard about the term they what is called elisa we didn't know about it we we were the students there since 90 i was working there at you since at you one we haven't had anything about elizabeth the terminology was not in the book or anywhere and anything about elizabeth in bangladesh till 1992 as we didn't know a lot about october it was 1971 on liberation war and i was also you know that i was a uh, the fighter i was injured so i was in indian military hospital I attended a hands-on workshop on Elizabeth in NLS Medical College, Kolkata, in October 1992, by the invitation of Professor Dr. Himan Day, who was the head of the department of orthopedic surgery and chairman of that Elizabeth workshop. That was the I first time because before that I was visiting one of the attending one conference, and he, Professor Himan Day, he was basically from our part of Bengal. so he he is born and brought up a little bit up to intermediate he was here so he he has got a lot of fascination he told me you come over here and join this new thing which is going to be first time in this eastern part of india so i attended there and hands on workshop three days workshop and it was totally amazing for me so i presented a paper on elizabeth on third boscon in february 1993 when today the history is this professor my professor samsuddin ahmed was chairing the session he also uttered that how come this is the not been i mean seen in our countries it was scatteredly here and there might be but in rasd then i can assure you that nobody was uttering the, his name or any his work in our uh, in our hospital particularly who is was the uh, the rasd is the mecca of, of our orthopedics in bangladesh in 19 in 1994 when i visited when i attended this eo course in singapore and i asked professor dorshep shanskar who was the chairman of the eo eo osteosynthesis you know so uh, he uh, he said no 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 we don't know about elizara we don't know what is elizara i don't know i said sir it is also maintaining the biology what you were telling today that biology 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 and but he still this is also a biology maintaining See, he said, "I don't know." And you see, after that, in 1996, when I was in Madras for a clinical experience under Gopala Krishnan, who was under direct train under the Mary Elizara Abraham Elizara as a musician from Kurgan. So, and then I started Elizara and never looked back. In this long journey, we I did. We have done hundreds and thousands of cases gradually from then on. and this is a for this country particularly for our developed underdeveloped countries we had a lot of problems which was a panacea i should say for our cases when failed all the cases 
particularly after fixation and neglected trauma cases, neglected open fractures, those horrible, but Elizera is the only answer. And of course, thanks to Professor Bari, actually, Professor Bari, actually, who has tuning the whole thing, because before 2002, he could not come to Dhaka, particularly in, in RASD. He was accommodated in RASD in, or Nitor, at that time it became Nitor. And so the things have been changed. And as we were doing scatteredly, but we are doing hundreds of cases, but he's a fine tuning he could have given to us. And this country has got a beautiful flavor from his direct experience from this Kurgan and his work to this, uh, I mean, uh, Russian, uh, all the musicians, particularly Elizabeth and other people. So this is a new beginning and we have, Together, we, we helped it, Bangladesh to the next level of uh, technical, technologically. So let us see some pictures, which is, a, I mean, uh, from Elizabeth Center in Kurgan, when we visited there in 19, in 2011. You see here, Professor Bari is here, and Upper Manjol Islam and all the senior teachers also here. And uh, you can see we were in, in this Elizabeth Center in 2011. We were so lucky, my wife and we, many of the orthopedic sergeants we have visited there. So this side, I mean, uh, his statue is there. We still remember that statue and we, we like to visit again and again, but unfortunately because of this pandemic, we, are, we cannot visit. And uh, this is uh, with our orthopedic society banner. We have carried this banner in that uh, center. So we were lucky and Dr. Bari has helped us to take over there. And uh, we could see so many things of this musician in that center. And we have also visited many places in, in that Russia. And Dr. here, my friend Rizvi, Abdul Ghani Mullah, and all these people sat there. So it's really uh, a wonderful visit we had. So gentlemen, it is, it is a fantastic technique and uh, what I am, because I am at very much attached to this AO, I am very much attached to the AO, I am as a chair of the AO in country. And what I feel there, the same, the stabilization and the biology, the, these, these two words are very much coincidence with this Elizabeth also, that is stability as well as the biology, which is in AO also said, and also in Elizabeth said. In many cases, in, in the developed world, where, where there is advantage, they are to doing it on the fixing on the very first day, second day, third day. While we are getting good cases, often I'm neglected, often cases. So we have to use it. And I would, I mean, I request my colleagues all should know about it because whenever you are putting trauma or some other cases. Elizabeth definitely has to play, has a play, uh, as a play to, as a role to play in our underdeveloped, underprivileged cities, I mean, countries. And uh, thank you, Professor Bari, and uh, all these foreign guests, Professor Harsha from Bangalore, and Jiang from China, and uh, uh, our, uh, this Kurgan, uh, is Constantin, yeah, he's, he's, yeah. We are sorry we like to visit this day. We should have visited your place. Thank you, sir, for your nice word. And we are feeling from heart that we are in Kurgan and joining with these days of centenary. We are uh, celebrating today. Salute, great salute to that musician of musician. Yeah, thank you so much. And thank you again. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your splendid and nostalgic speech. Now I would like to request Dr. Jiang Cheng Jiang from Beijing, China to share his experience regarding the journey of Elizarov. Could you please connect Dr. Jiang from China? Afternoon. Okay. Yeah, Dr. Chiang. Can can you hear us? Yes. Yeah. 
afternoon, dear friend, <laughs> Professor Bali, and Novikov. I'm very uh, uh, and uh, it is from why I can. Uh, we are. Many thanks Jalov in the important day. And uh, I would like my slide to show so something. And in presentation, small presentation, have, can you see that on my screen? Okay. Today, uh, 15 of June, I called it's the uh, yeah of day. In this year, I just uh, talk issues of trauma. Uh, I come from Beijing, the Secretary General of Assamese China. We are uh, of minded men. In this uh, important day, we must uh, talk uh, some uh, thing about Ididalov. It's my professor, he is the president of Asami China. He has a lot of experience about the deformity and the correction and the limb reconstruction. Also the honorary professor of the Life Center. In our institute, we have a lot of deformities like this. Lower limb or upper limb, we treat this. Uh, we go to some uh, data and uh, published some books. Last year, we just uh, published the new book with Springer, the name Lower Limb Deformities. So suddenly, uh, yeah, some, some cases show uh, like, like this, some severe uh, for the ankle deformities, we uh, treated as like this. Yeah, we finally got the good result. And uh, some, some patients like this, uh, the severe deformity of the ankle, Patient can't uh, work, and uh, how to do with the patient? And uh, in the college, no, no boy, no girlfriend to talk to to him. And uh, we can use our method to treat him. And finally, we can get a good result like this. During the processing, we must think about. What can we, how can we got a uh, result? During the meeting, we see our friend, Professor Bailey, also so similar case with us. He, with the method of Yilijanov, and talk about what's the Yilijanov method. And another case, trauma case, the infection and uh, some uh, narcosis with some implant. Only can you remove the implant, we got the good results with the bone transport. Finally, we can the chloro and the lament and the bone union and the good element. We also have some case with the sequela of traumatic trauma. So you can see here, loud to compartment syndrome, yeah, like this. So where we can give the insertion for the treatment? Yeah, we just uh, put the wire and the frame, gradually correction, we can go out. So good result. And uh, so give us some uh, inspiration. How can we treat the original the trauma? We prevent the compartment syndrome is very importantly. So in the treatment of the trauma case, the initial treatment is very important. The key is prevention. It's the philosophy Professor Idijalov gave to us. So we also have some case. Uh, deformity combines ulcer um, for the ankle. So we just, uh, uh, for this kind of deformity, we establish the Chinese therapy uh, only for the Bionobabida sequela. Professor Bailey, Professor Hardy Emma Murphy, 
and the Professor Shi Tu also is there. We also have some uh, uh, special treatment for the diabetic foot with transverse bone transport. We, we traveling to Kurgan uh, Center. We suddenly found the kingdom of external fixation. We found so many professors focus on the so interesting field of limb reconstruction. We found Professor Bailey, Professor Harsney, and the Professor Chin on the wall, and so on. And in the Itjalov Museum, we found the first case of Rumir, the non-union on tibia, the processing the, for treatment. We got a lot of the experience about the external fixation. And in tibia and femoral and the pelvic, many, many yeah, experience. After the discussing with the hero of Bangladesh, we called the Professor Bailey as the hero of Bangladesh. Uh, Bangladesh, we talk a lot. We must know that what's the essential of the idiot method. Yeah, this is my little son. Yeah, when they travel to Kurgan Center, we think a lot. What's the Ilidanov? When is Ilidanov? Where are we? How can we? And why is Ilidanov? And uh, from the simple deformity, we can give eyes argument. So in the, on the foot and ankle, we give the spot and give the direction. With the force, we can go to the correction. Like this, it's very simple. So during another meeting, Professor Bailey said that, why it is of intelligence? Lancing, infection, thick, thick, and adaptable, amazing opportunity and victory. This Ididalov, so very interesting Ididalov in the so important day. 100th anniversary celebration of Professor Ididalov, we must, we absolutely must to think about what's Ididalov. Its apparatus, its mindset, its concept, its uh, philosophy. Is uh, we must uh, say many thanks to Professor Ilidalo. And uh, in China, in this year, we have four journals published. One is GOT Journal Orthopedic Translation. We have a special journal just for the illegal technique development in China. And other three Chinese journal, Chinese Journal of Orthopedics and some Chinese journal, born and joint surgery and some practical orthopedics journal. Totally uh, more than 60 people published together. Thanks to Professor Ili Jalov. And in this weekend, we also have another big meeting in Shijiazhuang city of Hebei, just the south of capital Beijing. We held the Chinese summit on external fixation and labor construction. And at the same time, we hold the symposium on the humility and academy for the 100th anniversary of celebration of Idi Jalov. So, and another meeting in the near future. So you must remember that in the World Congress uh, in uh, Lisbon, the common meeting for ILAS and ASAMI International, decide by voting. The 2023 World Meeting will be held in Beijing by us. So, what a joy is to have friends coming from. Welcome all the friends coming to Beijing to talk and uh, uh, to think, to do the Ididal of thing. When I visited the Corgan Center in the time we visited the tube 
to uh, for Professor Ilijalov. We think a lot, but anyway, we will uh, go ahead and keep going in this Ilijalov way and work hard. Thank you. Thank you for your attention. Thank you. Thank you very much, Professor Jiang from Beijing, China. Now I would like to request one of our legendary professor and highly academic teacher, Professor Abdullah Al Rijvi sir, as a national faculty to join with us and say something regarding the hundred years of Elizarov. Would you please connect, Professor Kondukar Abdul Al Rijvi sir? Uh, thank you, Dr. Tanvi. Uh, for giving me the chance. Okay, first of all, uh, I would like to thank uh, Ashami Bangladesh for organizing such a beautiful uh, uh, mixed session, scientific and non-scientific in a way. Uh, my regards to Professor Samsuddin Ahmed, my teacher, and other uh, faculties who are friends of mine, local faculties, and international faculties, many of them are very close to me as well, like those of Ashad. Okay. Today is the uh, 100th birth anniversary of uh, uh, one of the one of the greatest uh, uh, surgeon of the last century, uh, Professor Gabriel Lizarro. Uh, he is uh, truly a great uh, Russian surgeon. If we look at the history, you will see hardly you will find any sur Russian surgeon who has been able to cross their boundaries and been accepted by the West as a as a as a famous surgeon. The uh, exception is uh, Professor Elizaro. Not only that, if you if you, if you see, uh, you will hardly see any surgeon in the world who has been uh, so well known in almost every corner of the art today, like Professor Elizaro. In Bangladesh, Professor Elizaro is uh, very uh, famous and he's very close to us, dear to us, because uh, in Bangladesh, uh, almost all the trauma surgeons when they are in uh, trouble, in fixing difficult uh, fractures, they refer to Elizabeth's system. Because uh, in many of our areas, we have uh, uh, poor uh, physical settings. So in that situation, Elizabeth can be only hope. In my whole career, in orthopedic career, many occasions I've been I've been uh, 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 get over difficult situations by the Elizabeth system and his teaching so I am grateful to personally grateful to uh, Gabriel Elizaro he has left us he is no more with us he left this world in 19. Uh, 92. But if you look at the world now, his present is uh, uh, much stronger. Recording in progress. His presence is much stronger and greater than before. So, my tribute to him, and I pray for his uh, departed soul. Uh, with these uh, few words and my tributes. I would like to conclude my speech. And before that, I would like to thank all the faculties, foreign faculties and local faculties uh, for their participation. And, uh, and thank you again, Dr. Bari. Uh, Bari is the ambassador of Elizabeth in the world now. And uh, because of him and some of our uh, uh, young uh, Elizabeth surgeons, Elizabeth system is now uh, improving and developing much faster in Bangladesh. So, by, I, my, my uh, personal thanks 
to Bari as well. He is a close friend of mine, personal friend. So we are proud of you with this reverse and Bari. Goni Mulla is the Secretary General of Asami. Uh, Goni Mulla, thank you for organizing this uh, program. And also, also my uh, thanks to uh, Bangladesh Orthopedic Society for facilitating this program. And uh, these words, thank you again. Thank you, Hasrat. Thank you, Jang. Thank you, Russian Professor. Okay, Professor uh, Amjad. And uh, I cannot see so many friends. And they are, and also my special thanks to people who have been connected. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Professor Khandokala Prabhu sir. I would like to thank Raj TV and Ortho TV for transmitting our program. And you can connect us on Facebook. And it's a great honor for us that Ortho TV is with us. I would like to thank the Ortho TV team as well as the Raj TV team. Now, I would like to request Recording our international stopped. faculty, Professor Harshad, sir, from India. Would you please connect Professor Harshad, sir, yes, with sir. us? Uh, so Recording in progress. Thank you, uh, Dr. Uh, Mr. Tanvir, Dr. Tanvir. Uh, is it uh, shared? No. Share screen. What is coming? Okay. Can you see my screen? How do you do this? No. Huh? Yes, create this pen. Uh, no, so go to side mode. Big screen. Go to side mode. Okay. Yes. yes. Yeah. Good. Same. This is okay. Sir, please go full screen, sir. This is okay. Yeah, eighty percent okay, sir. One second. One. Recording second. stopped. Make make it full screen, sir. Please. Is it okay. Ah, full screen. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, 100% okay. Perfect, sir. But uh, these photos are coming in the way. Okay, fine. Uh, sorry for this little bit. Uh, this one, I'm an illegal surgeon, not an electronic surgeon. I should thank our young and handsome man, Tanvir, for allowing me and calling me here onto this. I envy him. I prefer his job to my job. This Elizabeth technique is a very, very, very uh, simple technique, but at the same time, it is treated for the most complex cases. Hence, nobody in the world wants to do Elizabeth technique or learn this technique initially. But once they learn, they will love it. Recording in progress. TV and auto TV also for all these things. And I'm amongst my oldest of friends, Dr. Bari. I started with him and then Dr. Skonkar, Dr. Amjad, and also my uh, pronouns to Professor Shamsud Ahmad. And uh, after Professor uh, uh, Ilizarao, I came to know, of course, I have not met Professor Ilizarao. I wish I had. I came to know uh, Professor uh, Shepso and finally Dr. Noviko. My namaskar to Noviko and Jang has been a close friend for a long time. So, ladies and gentlemen, today is the 100th uh, year and birthday of Professor Elizarao. And I should congratulate Dr. Bari for conducting not only one day, but for a whole month, uh, this one. We, uh, we envy that uh, sorry we are not in Russia at this time. Otherwise, 100% would have been in Russia. As for this corona problem, this was conducted last year and uh, I mean last time. And we were there, we had a video. And this time, today, it is going to be uh, our experience and journey. I forgot uh, uh, Dr. Abdul Ghani Mullah, a very, very close friend of mine after Bari. And we have had a long, long, nice association. I've been in Bangladesh for more than 10 times for all Bangladesh meetings, Asami meetings, as well as their annual meetings. Today, we have a big number of people on the TV, on Raj TV, with all these people on the list. Professor Elizarao, no doubt, he should 
have been awarded the biggest prize in the world and i do not know which is bigger than nobel prize if there was something he should have got it otherwise he is the one who has probably uh discovered the best thing in orthopedics everybody puts implants this that everything is there of course everything adds to all the history but what he has discovered is generating new tissue that is known as histio neogenesis all the tissues if it is bone it is osteo neogenesis if it is muscle myo neogenesis etc 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 so when you stretch a cut bone the skin the muscles the nerves the vessels and the bones everything grows everything has its own time to grow but everything grows and this was basically discovered and not only discovered the whole thing has been standardized by him for at least 20 25 years from 1951 when he invented his rings he started doing this and it came out into the world only in the 1980s late 1980s so imagine from 1951 to 1985 35 years he has been working with this in all the labs all the tests everything has been done ready made for the whole world the whole world has improvised a little bit a very we little bit of probably 5 to 10% of what professor elizaro has done as one man of course professor shefso was with him and uh, i should say namaskar gosh with say namaste good afternoon to all i come from ramaya medical college bangalore obviously this is my old hospital which looks like a palace i mean medical college building which looks like a palace they wanted to bring the front part of it has come down and is being converted to a university but i prefer these kind of buildings than these routine buildings what are there everywhere from china to usa to europe to australia etc professor elizaro rings somehow i managed to get this particular ring here and this shining thing came like the eclipse and this has changed the whole world of mine elizaro center lot has been told about the elizaro center and professor elizaro by everybody after that professor shefso has been my mentor and he has been the director for elizaro center for 25 years that means almost half a decade or more professor shefso has been with elizaro as well as with this and i am very very fortunate to learn with him and then be faculty with him all thanks to bari as well as our other people in india there he is we have very good light moments with him and he is so young with us and in spite of being so old compared to us he is much more stronger and he operates for 5 10 hours continuously without getting tired such a great man i get all inspiration from him this is in the first international assami conference which bari conducted i was there and he also sometimes get some beautiful secretaries Yeah. that glass which he has put has been gifted by me which was for when i knew that she is coming now after that <coughs> professor alexander gubin he had become a very close friend of ours because of again going to russia a few times and then dr borzno and many 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 more like professor noviko who was the latest friend of ours other than katania etc the chinese have been meeting us dr zhang particularly and then dr quincy he professor quincy he uh, and in all conferences across the world and we kept became very very close friends with them with many other people all the names seem similar and then they called me to china and what hospitality what beautiful this one their hospital the government has helped them so much i wish we had a government of their kind i wish we had patients also of their kind we do of course china and india are having the same population with the same problems and we could treat all these patients with this one and all of them get together in china malaysia everyone all of us are almost the same international group everywhere you can see jhang is there dr quincy is there kamal osni is there uh, saik is there i am there and of course bari and everybody will be there all the time you can see here again from malaysia from india from abroad bari is there and malaysian this dr gani what we see him today is totally different compared to what we see him then and dr abdul gani with a strong amitabh bachchan kind of voice 
has been a great inspirator for not only treating illiterate patients but also for some kind of administrative advice political advice that i got from him and accordingly i have seen to it that i have implemented here there i have conducted uh, illiterate uh, cadaveric workshop also so every single pin how it is to be applied every single half pin how to apply how to fix the rings on to different parts of the leg all my post graduates all post graduates consultant from across the country and world attend these meetings invitations are given to the best of people across with a large faculty so if we have say 30 candidates whom we train cadaveric workshop we have on each table only two or three students and we have one or two faculty for each student and each one of them gets so personalized training that they can go back and do surgeries on simple cases like tibia fractures compound fractures by putting illiterate surgery because they have learned here within 3 days of time it is not so easy but then it is not so impossible of course my salutations other than the professor illiterate professor shefso professor naviko to also outside people like professor dr pel he is the one who has simplified my illiterate by saying that complications are minimized by changing the nomenclature and of course the speciality of illiterate limb lengthening and reconstruction has been expanded to treat all these difficult conditions by even different methods where possible or combined method there professor bari we both are like uh, elder brothers and younger brother or younger brother and young, uh, elder brother both are same age and the noviko is here who has been with us uh, in bangalore for the cadaveric workshop and done some surgeries and helped us a lot he has operated on my family and we have in our medical college professor uh, sandeep reddy also who does illiterate surgery with me of more than 15 to 20 years experience we have dr ashok kumar who has got 15 20 years experience i have trained more than 200 people and we have done conferences workshops cadaveric workshops cme live surgeries webinars etc etc across my country you name the city most probably we would have done some workshop or meeting or the other this is what i have learned i have mastered illiterate technique to some extent but then illiterate has got 15 departments under various specialties of illiterate for infection three department for deformity corrections for limb lengthening for pelvis for spine for hand and surgery upper limb lower limb etc etc so when all those are specialities which are treated by illiterate external fixed i am just a general orthopedic illiterate surgeon where i treat all of them to a large extent and probably i don't know how to treat many of them and we will have super specialities under illiterate also in future just like russia i think russia is the only country in the world which has got more than 800 beds which has got departments of 14 or 15 departments which where each department sticks to its specialty of orthopedics like pediatric orthopedics is a department like that but we here are individuals who try to do everything so it's not very simple for us this was the illiterate workshop photograph the whole workshop cadaveric workshop which was which has been put in dr bari's nursing home he is one fellow you go from top to bottom in his hospital you will get photos of everywhere across the world that was in brazil i have also traveled across the world more than 70 times i think and the biggest conference which we have conducted is when professor junjunwala was the assam international president i was one of the uh, organizing vice presidents that time and people from across the world were there some of them who were uh, here are there and we had a wonderful time and one of the best conferences held across the country i think the next conference will be with dr jang in 19 i mean 2023 and probably they will you should not miss it they will do it in a fantastic way uh, my this one was to keep on training everybody like i told you i have trained more than 200 doctors post graduates foreigners etc we have presented more than 3 400 papers across the world so that helps us to learn more and more and more about illiterate and professor illiterate's book has been my bible my quran and my book on my this one my mahabharata and my uh, ramayana because every time we go into it he has got hundreds and hundreds of illustrations line diagrams which make things very easy for us and of course professor bari's books all of them are with me. many of them are there and there are many other books by written by many people my aim is of course to see that this illiterate method
comes into our postgraduate curriculum so that all postgraduates will be able to learn at least the basic electro technique so that they will be able to teach and treat patients later in future learn better either in russia or our centers or dr bari centers and all that. a few cases infection i was telling is one of the worst dreaded problems for orthopedic surgeon any fracture any problem you put an implant you may get when you get infection you cannot put any implant so what happens such particular infected cases or congenital cases you can put in there are some cases i'll show you we talk about infection later a few cases only uh, here you got cross deformity cross shortening no bone growth in between poor bone growth of one so when you have so many problems in these things it is impossible to treat conventionally it is not impossible but it's very difficult and you will not get good results and failure rates are very 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 high so this is one condition where elizarov is the only method of treatment and the best method of treatment there are new methods being devised by everybody every day the world technology keeps improving but you can see such a small leg such a deformed leg has become straight and the child has become normal this is known as congenital pseudoarthrosis of tibia so lot of congenital cases we get how do we do limb lengthening all of them dr jhang as others others were saying limb lengthening is done gradually the tissues grow by 1 mm per day so if you have 10 cm it will take 10 months for the limb to grow 10 cm that's the minimum and it will become normal a short leg short femur broken femur deformed femur i'm sorry i'm not showing so much because of time there it is deformed the hip joint we have treated this i have created special pins for this with stoppers and then that's the leg you can see the leg has been cut we call it as osteotomy or corticotomy in two sides and finally this girl's leg has become so long there you can see that is the x ray from top to bottom the whole thing is one leg you can see there that is the hip joint that is the hip joint the knee joint in this normal leg is here the knee joint in the normal leg other leg is here so look at the difference and that leg has been grown 26 cm right that is the way walking normally yeah anything deformed forearm you can see short forearm one of the bones long forearm we have cut in two places put some wires inside and from that kind of situation she has become normal a relative of mine who came all the way from maharashtra got it done in my village very very crooked limbs and all that can be made straight there are plenty and plenty of cases to show now you can see this small video this is the most ghastly thing that we can have there is lot of infection no treatment possible this patient had come okay uh, most of our patients with infection have this problem no bone they will have gaps and they will have abnormal mobility and 50% used to go to amputation before elizaro came once i learned elizaro surgery elizaro surgery helped in curing all these patients there you are the whole thing is grown the bone has been regrown and this is the boy he had infected non union in this whole area for which he had spent 1 and 1/2 crore rupees in usa when he was there when he came back he searched for me and then fortunately i could cure him in only 25 lakh rupees the whole thing after doing five surgeries but then is totally normal now that is his x ray nowadays some more additional things are being added this is computerized deformity correction device known as suv 6 axis it this was a particular uh, done by dr solomon also from russia there are tsf other things of this kind well ladies and gentlemen this is only a small introduction a small story for you all the elizaro story is so big so big that a whole orthopedics can be super specialized into elizaro methods and elizaro treatment basically for limb lengthening for correction of deformities and for infected non union and gaps in long long bones where of any cause we can regrow the bone by bone transport as well as limb lengthening spasiba shukriya thank you so much i love elizaro very much he's been my passion i love bangladesh also and i thank everybody and i thank raj tv and ortho tv and finally our handsome young man again tanvir for allowing me to talk and final best thanks goes to dr bari three cheers to him thank you so much thank you sir thank you for your splendid speech and Recording we all love you also sir now i would like to thank ortho tv for telecasting our program
And definitely, I would like to thank Dr. Shamsul Huda to act as a coordinator in Ortho TV. Now, I would like to request Dr. Shamsul Huda to join with us. Would you please connect Dr. Shamsul Huda? I think uh, he is facing some sort of network problem in their countries there. Now, I would like to request Dr. Shamsul Huda to join with us, the Joint Secretary of Assam India. Would you please connect Dr. Shamsul Huda to join with us? I think uh, he is facing some sort of network problem there. I think uh, we better connect him in the next part as because of uh, we are in short of time. Now I would like to request to present a magnificent presentation by one of our magnificent Elizabeth young Elizabeth surgeon, Dr. Miraj Mullah. I would like to request Dr. Meraj Mullah to present his presentation. Assalamu alaikum, good morning, and uh, it is a great privilege to present something in the uh, occasion of 100th birthday anniversary of legendary scientist Professor G. A. Elizarov. I am Dr. Mohammad Mirajuddin Mullah, a junior orthopedic surgeon working as an Elizarov surgeon. It is not actually a presentation, it is my proposal that the history that Elizarov has brought a revolutionary and radical change in the subject of orthopedics. But there was no solution except amputation. Now there is every chance of limb salvage and functionality. So to my opinion, total orthopedics can be divided into two era, pre elizaro era and post elizaro era. What we used to do in the pre elizaro era, we now uh, don't do in the post elizaro era. So orthopedic surgery textbook also can be uh, include this. The, the Elizaro comprises basically two things, the Elizaro technique and Elizaro devices. In technique, revolutionary changes in bone and soft tissue biology and regeneration have been introduced. And Elizabeth device, it is a multiplanar, versatile, fixator, even we can consider it as a dynamic implant. What we uh, do in a Bangladesh perspective, I wanted to uh, sh show you something. The distraction osteogenesis, uh, it is a comparative, uh, actually, the comparative study, the comparative uh, analysis. What we used to do for distraction osteogenesis for length, bone lengthening. In pre reserve era, we used to do oblique osteotomy. Sometimes we put bone graft in this, uh, but it had limitations. There are growing nails after uh, recently developed, but not uh, available in Bangladesh. So we can forget about that. So in uh, after the advent of Lizaro, now uh, we know how to lengthen bone. There is no limitation, we can lengthen it uh, 3 inch, 4 inch, uh, 6 inch, uh, uh, there is no limitation. In infected non-union, there was it was a nightmare for orthopedic surgeons. No implant could be used. Some used antibiotic cement spacers with unilateral legs fix. But nowadays, it can be easily managed with excision of all dead bones, making a gap and bone transport with the of corticotomy. Like this one, you can see in a very bad case of humerus what has been treated by laser open. open fractures, uh, we, we, in Bangladesh, it was very difficult to fix uh, earlier. Usually we applied unilateral X-fix, which later become non-unions. But uh, after the advent of laser open, we can be used as a definite primary and definitive fixation device. Some aseptic non-unions were very problematic uh, with, uh, before laser uh, was discovered. But they, uh, we have to use multiple surgeries was done, but still uh, non-union occurred as they are, it was, those are avascular type. But now we can excise as much avascular bone as required and transport bone with particular, there is no problem with doing that. Deformity correction has, uh, yeah, with the erasure of deformity correction has become very much easier. Bone deformity can be corrected. Earlier in pre-leisure of era, 
some osteotomies were done, uh, but uh, the soft tissue were difficult to manage. Extensive release of soft tissue made sometimes uh, amputation was also required. But after the advent of religion of uh, the, uh, the gradual osteo and corti after corticotomy and osteotomy, the using the open waste principles without any bone graft, deformity can be corrected very easily. And joint and soft tissue contractures are very, too, very easy to correct without any release of soft tissue. Like this one, you can see a bad case of Terry Jam earlier tried to correct with um, uh, vascular um, um, uh, soft tissue release but failed. Then it was easily corrected with Elizabeth. Difficulty fractures, there are some difficult fractures which have very little uh, space uh, for screws and plates. Uh, the risk of skin blowout uh, and also amputation was required for this type of fractures. But with Elizabeth, uh, this uh, uh, fine wire technique, actually it is an illusor of technique, it is very easy to manage and it can also be used as joint spanning fixator, ligamentotax is very much easy with uh, this device, so many very difficult fractures can be managed with illusor also. In Parthes disease we have done some uh, cases here, here in Bangladesh, uh, earlier it was done with virus derotation osteotomy mostly which were a younger age group and which uh, in those uh, there was enough time for remodeling. But for older age group and uh, severe case, there was nothing to do actually. But after Elijah uh, we uh, with arthrodiastasis, we can achieve greater remodeling even after the age of 11 or 12. This improves a lot of hip function and preserves the joint. You can see this, uh, this was a bad case of a 10 years old boy, uh, which was uh, arthrodiastasis was done. And now there is a good remodeling of the femur head. Osteoarthritis, even in osteoarthritis, Lizero has a great role. Uh, like uh, high tibial osteotomy, we do in uh, earlier, uh, but very difficult with plates and screws as there was little space for holding the screws. But with the Lizero device, high tibial osteotomy can be done very easily. And there is also some study that it is a, actually an avian uh, osteoarthritis. So uh, some wires, if put in the femur, uh, re reaching the subcondral bones, can increase the blood supply and uh, increase the chondro chondrocyte uh, and cartilage. In PVD, uh, there was a, though it is not an orthopedic subject, it is a uh, subject of vascular and general surgery, but uh, the has role in this. Our professor Bari have uh, done lots of blood surgery disease. In uh, pre 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 it was usually treated by bypass graft, but uh, for small vessels, there was nothing to do. But nowadays, uh, we can do tibial widening, which increases lots of metaphyseal and interosseous blood supply. And so the, the limb can be salvaged. Cosmetic height increment, before pleasure of it was not possible to gain height after a skeletal maturity. And nowadays it, it is uh, developed, some intermediary growing nerves are developed. But uh, after pleasure of uh, it occurred actually. So uh, now any height can be achieved by any person. There is no limit of age. Though Bangladesh there are few cases, but world has uh, worldwide the number of cases are rising. Like this boy who has gained uh, three inches. Arthrodesis was a difficult job earlier. Uh, failure rate was high, difficult in presence of infection. Charlie device was used in knee and ankle. Sometimes internal implants were also used, but after release of uh, uh, it can be applied as joint spanning fixator. So uh, arthrodesis has become very easier, like this uh, ankle. Uh, this is a important uh, aspect of Elijah Rob to reconstruct tibia. Uh, most uh, in pre Elijah Rob era, long gaps of uh, uh, tibia was difficult to manage, but now any part of tibia can be uh, reconstructed with the help of uh, horizontal transport of fibula. You can see this one. Elijah Rob in spine, there is lots of pro there are lots of prospects, but uh, in Bangladesh only, Professor Imambari has started this in some cases of PLID and bus fracture. Scoliosis can be corrected with Elijah Rob. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you very much, Dr. Ramirez Mullah, for your excellent presentation. Now, I would like to request one of our very renowned professors from NITOL, 
Professor Jahangir Alam sir to say something regarding his journey to the hundred years of Elizarov. Professor Jahangir Alam sir. Thank you, Tanvir. And today is the that day when a great orthopedic surgeon of the world, a magician of Kurgan, is came to this world, and during his life, he served the deformed, infected, and neglected orthopedic patients and he is delighted to the whole world by his work. In our country, we have learned from many things from, from Elizarov through our great professor, mm -hmm. Professor M. M. Bari and Professor mm -hmm. Dr. Mohammad Abdul Ghani Mullah. Initially, when we are the resident of this institution, when everything is in to failure, like infected non-union, then we have planned for that treatment by Elijarov, and many people got benefited from this method. So I have to honor every people of the world who are dealing with this magic treatment in this 100th anniversary birthday of Elizabeth. Salute to everybody from Bangladesh Orthopedic Society and Nature to treat such complicated patients like deformity, infected non inone and where some treatment is failed. And I am ending my speech again salute to our great professor, Professor Bari, Professor Abdul Ghani Mullah, Professor Harshad, our close friends of Bangladesh, Professor Rizvi sir, Professor Shamsuddin sir, and who are live in this program. Thank you, everybody from our institution and our society. Thank you. Thank you very much, Professor Jahangir Alam, sir. Now, I would like to request our technical team to join all the members who are with us in silent mood. Please make them unmute. I would like to thank all the members who are with us. Before I go into that part, I would like to request uh, Dr. Shamsul Huda to say something, which is Dr. Shamsul Huda from Ortho TV. Hello, good afternoon. Can you hear my voice? Yeah, we can hear you. Please proceed on. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Very good afternoon, uh, Dr. Kamid. Thanks to Asami Bangladesh to give me space to speak at this grand moment of 100 years of Elizabeth. I would like to thank, give regards to our mentors, Professor Mbari sir, Professor Hacha Sah sir, Professor Navibov sir, Manimullah sir, Shamsuddin sir, Professor Jang sir, and my friend Dr. Tanvi, Dr. Shetu and Raj TV. Elizabeth has been like a long journey for me few years back. I used to do routine complex trauma surgeries to mental study due to lack of a technique we can treat all impossible cases. Or amputation would have been an option. And I felt need of an advanced training to treat these cases, these patients to treat here at my city. So I joined Assam India, learned from different faculty and courses. I learned from Dr. Harsha, Dr. Julian Wala sir, Dr. Ari Agarwal sir, Dr. Manish Savan, Dr. Ruta Kulkarni sir, Dr. Milin Chaudhary sir, Dr. Suresh Bola sir, 
my uh, partner's mentor, Dr. John Mukhopadhyay sir, Dr. Ayat Prakash sir, and of course, Professor Bali sir always guided me in every moment. And then I went to Baltimore, USA for advanced reformed uh, courses. And Dr. Hazenberg, Michael Asayag, another international faculty, I learned different techniques from Dr. Shirso, Professor Navika, Dr. Solomon, Dr. Victor, Professor Gamal, Hosni, Dr. Hamuda, and many more, Professor Fidel. And then uh, with learning, I became Joint Secretary of Assam in India. To way to go ahead. Now I'm treating the magic of Elizabeth virus cases like complex bone infection, limb learning, deformity correction, and master the art of bone and tissue regeneration. I haven't seen Professor Elizabeth so all my mentors actually here. I I'm face of Professor Elizabeth here. So when you suddenly treating with conventional orthopedic surgery, the magic of Elizabeth, she is all impossible cases to normal with this of biology. Thanks. Thanks from uh, love from India. Thanks a lot. Hello. Now, I would like to request our technical team to join all the members uh, who participate with us in Zoom ID. Please uh, show them in the screen so that uh, so that we can identify. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, is it from? Uh, are are you from uh, uh, ch China or are you from India? The uh, right one, the spectacles ones. I can uh, read out your name clearly. Can you can you hear me? The right right one, the most right one, the second right one. Me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I'm I'm Chianin. Uh, from Thailand, uh, Thailand Asami Group. Uh, thank you for the recording invitation. in progress. Thank you for the invitation to join this um, this meeting. Uh, it's, it's my honor, and uh, thank you to the organizer and the host of this meeting. Yes, yeah. uh, I think uh, it is a lot of apparatus and its application are uh, uh, a very valuable treatment for the mankind. I hope that we will have this activity as the regular events in the future. And if you want my assistance in this activity, please do not hesitate to contact me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you Recording very much stopped. for joining with us. Uh, now I'd like to request the uh, middle one, uh, the middle uh, senior person. Uh, we cannot read out your name. Uh, would you please uh, Raise your hand and uh, tell your name uh, to us and say something. The middle man in the uh, screen. Uh, the technical team would uh, focus the middle person in full screen, please. Uh, Dr. Vikash Kumar. Yeah. Dr. Vikash Kumar, sir, please. Would you uh, good say up. something? Yeah, good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon to everyone. Thank you. Uh, I'm the student of uh, Elizarov student uh, Ivanovich in um, Russia. I finished my orthopedic at Russia one year course there. So uh, I got the chance to see uh, near to Kuragan. And thanks to Elisa Zorov, 100 years we have celebrating today. Thanks again, Magic Man, Spasipaza, Inoi. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much for being with us. Uh, now, uh, I want to hand over the microphone to the uh, prestigious person. Uh, our those uh, who are participating in this uh, uh, program, and uh, I would like to uh, give our thanks. I would like to give our thanks to them. If anybody want to say something, uh, please raise your hand, and you can connect with us. The floor is open for all. 
you can share your experience with us. Okay. Rajiv, you will be a leader for a long time. So, you please, you please go to the dais and say something. Please, go to the dais. Sorry, I had a bad network. I just came to Nifar now. Assalamu alaikum. I'm Dr. Rajiv Ambit, working in Nitur as a uh, junior consultant and working in Elizabeth Unit for the last uh, five to seven years. Uh, first of all, I especially thanks to my uh, recent mentor, uh, Dr. Nazmul Dashidu sir, because he is reminding me uh, first that uh, this 15th June is a 100 year celebration of Great Elizabeth Surgeon. Uh, great um, Elizabeth Surgeon, Mr. Uh, Professor G.A. Elizabeth Sir. Uh, now I want to say something about Elizabeth. Uh, for with Elizabeth, where we are uh, um, in past, with those uh, uh, limb what is uh, going to amputate, now we can save this uh, by this Elizabeth. And especially, very much especially uh, acting in uh, infected non-union and deformity correction. And especially I do many deformity correction with uh, this is a, like uh, telepath, equine, uh, congenital telepathy equinovirus and equinus foot, CT, uh, CPT, congenital pseudotus of tibia, and um, uh, uh, like um, genovirus, genovalgus, many, many different deformity cases, and uh, apply a lot of laser of. Uh, apply some uh, Elizabeth in uh, many uh, failure cases also, like uh, uh, infected non-union in femur, the, um, tibia, and uh, radius ulna also, and humerus. So uh, I can uh, um, uh, say it shortly that Elizabeth uh, um, uh, give us a new era in orthopedics in orthopedic treatment and it is a fast uh, if you uh, want to um, do Elizabeth, this is a very vast vast answer for this uh, i welcome you all especially young surgeon like me or my juniors to join Elizabeth unit in nitor and uh, you are i am encouraging all of you uh, that you have to uh, give some time in uh, Elizabeth unit with us. Now I just uh, thanks especially to our uh, um, um, Professor Bari sir for um, the uh, mentor of all of us, for the mentor of all us. And uh, lastly, I special thanks to uh, my uh, unit chief and director, Professor uh, Abdul Ghani Mullah sir for Engine success, beautiful, and uh, conducting meeting in Elizabeth. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you, Dr. Rajiv. You are doing the Elizabeth for a long time. So you can say something in this August gathering. So thank you very much from the core of our heart. Now, I would request Dr. Shethu, the mentor of Dr. Rajiv. Dr. Shadu is Justin professor, and he's the he's the key person now in uh, actually the network. So I think Dr. Shadu, you please say something. Yeah. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you, sir. Uh, at first, on the eve of the 100 years birthday celebration of Irijaram, uh, the our mentor, Professor Bari sir, our director sir, and our uh, teachers in front uh, our audience. Uh, Assalamu alaikum. At first, I uh, grateful and thankful to our participants, our great teachers, Amzad sir, Mizbi sir, 
and uh, uh, queries are and uh, out, outside of the uh, our country and lovikov sir and harshas sir also and from chin jang sir thank you all when i invited our uh, program uh, for this uh, session uh, and also i thankful to our director sir for uh, encourage us to organize this uh, session very nicely and on the uh, from our bari sir we taught from uh, we learned from him the elizarov method and its applications now we can uh, disseminate the method to our followers and for, to the learners how to correct the deformity how to bone transport lean lending and etc it's a magic and it's a magic of elizarov and without elizarov we cannot think about this our uh, today and we now we see that a lot of people are coming and planning about this method on the eve of the 100 year celebration we again thank to our great scientist academician elizaro and thankful thank to our sirs thank you all thank you thank you dr rajmal hoda shetu and definitely my friend uh, dr kokon for his nice speech now i would like to request for the last presentation from our honorable director sir the president of bangladesh orthopedic society and the secretary of assami very prestigious professor dr abdul goni molla sir professor dr abdul goni molla sir again bismillah arrahman arrahim uh today's president the president of assami bangladesh chapter professor mufakkul bari our big guys in the field of orthopedic era in the field of elizar of inda not only in the country but also in the in the world also not in the subcontinent but in the world also he was our inspiration he was our mentor he was our great teacher and he dealt the complicated cases in such a way that in bangladesh there are many elizar of surgery in the country and they are helping the patient helping the mankind in this regard so 100 year birth the anniversary i salute from the core of my heart but before him many of the elizar of surgery in the country professor abdul samad sheikh or ex director of nidor he died he, he just he has been gone to his great majority that is he died Two three months back, he was our director of Nitor. He started in Elizarov, in the periphery region in the country, particularly in the Rampur, in the Borishal. He started, and he also started in the Elizarov in the Arad Diden Arasdi. Now Nitor, he is no more in the country. So may Almighty Allah bless him with eternal peace. 
The second guy, he was also our mentor in the different aspect of the orthopedic surgeon. Professor M. Jamjadushin, the war on the freedom fighters in the country. He was a great freedom fighter. He was always, he is, always, he is the man who has a good hand in all the sub brands of the orthopedic surgery. Particularly, he started in the Lejaro. When he started in Nitor, many, many people are laughing. When Professor Abdul Samad Sheikh has started there in Belshan for the sake of the homo sapiens in the, in the country, then everybody laughs. So, Professor Amjad Ushel, he has a good hand to all the, all the super study of the orthopedic surgery. Where he, he is not. He is in the Elizabeth, he is in the hands, he is in the general orthopedics. Now he is in the great replacement orthopedic, uh, replacement orthopedic surgeon in the country. If and me. So, I saluted in this August gathering and in this August day, Elizabeth Day, 100 years birth the anniversary of Elizabeth Day. I also remembered that two guys. So, but after coming back from Russia and after coming back to NATO, particularly in RSD, when Professor Bari is coming, Elizabeth is everywhere. And he invented the Elizabeth from the core of his heart when he was also controversial throughout the country by the senior and junior doctors. But now he is the reputed, he is the mentor, he is the philosopher, what not. But he was also a controversial man in the country, in the field of Elizabeth. So, Gabriel Elizabeth is also controversial in his time also. He was the cock by the doctors. He was called by the cock. He was called as a cock when he invented this frame, this type of, this method of Elizabeth in his country in the last part of 40s, I think, or first part of the 50s. He was called quack, quack, quack doctor, you know, everybody you know, quack, Hathuray doctor. Also, he was born in Poland in a very less developed in the Jews family, his Jews family, in a very poor family. And they came to Russia and settled in Kurgan for their maintenance of the family. He was educated and he was becoming a doctor and becoming an orthopedic surgeon. Just after Second World War, there are so many injured, injured people in, the, in his country. You know, the history of Second World War, I don't want to go that uh, side. He still in the 50s, 60s and 70s, in his own subcontinent in Europe, his method was not accepted by the senior doctors. First of all, in Italy, maybe, the Cadagni, he was a great orthopedic surgeon and great Elizabeth surgeon. He was the man who followed the rules and resolutions made by the Elizabeth. And you are here to in in 60s, 70s and the 80s a whole Europe the Elizabeth method was popularized. In America, United States of America, it was not popularized before 90s. Can you understand? Abhiyakta Abhishkar Korven this is the sadness in the part of the, the inventor, in the part of the inventor, in the discoverer. So now Professor Harjanbar, Professor Dor Pale, they are the renowned orthopedic surgeon as well as the Elizabeth of Surgeon all over the world in the department of the department of the Now in the field of our country and our subcontinent. When Professor Shevchov, the second man of the disciple of Elizabeth, Professor Gabriel Elizabeth, Shevchov is coming to the country by the invitation of our mentor, Professor Bonard, Professor Bari. 
we are inspired, our country is inspired, our orthopedic surgeons are inspired, and we have a hope, we had a hope and to continue our hope for the sake of the people. And in the subcontinent, in the world also, he is the second man of Shepsov. He is the very nice interpreter of Shepsov. Interpreter of Shepsov. And that's why Professor, Honored Professor Bari is not only in his country, he is congratulated, he is the good teacher of China, India, and also in Europe. So I saluted in this August turn to Professor Bari sir also. So Elizabeth method, you know that I, I don't want to go. I don't want to go to Elizabeth. This is a fracture of femur. You, you, you please see. And the orthopedic surgeon had done open detection internal fixation in such a way, the nice presentation, nice operation. But what is the fate? This is the fate. This is a huge pass of there. You know that there is a huge pass of there. And there is no, from the orthopedic side point of view, what you are doing, what you are want to do, you just remove all the things, debride and wait for the months together, years together. But if you have a hand of Elizabeth, please go on, you can something and you have a great, you will be great pleasure that you have to, you have, and ultimately the man is now okay, is still for the last three years, he has been put in, put the Elizabeth frame in his in situ in his femur. Let's say. So you know, there is a long bone, there is a humerus, implant failure, there is a pus, discharging sinus years for for, years, for for months together. What you are doing? Again, same thing. I am very much interested for the infective non-union. And I had been, I, 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 I have no sleep in the night when, we are, when I am going to be do some operation in this regards. And very interesting, but you have to be, you have to be patient and you have to be known, education, known. And you have to know the safe zone of also, the particular in the long bones, safe zones. This is the digital part of the in, uh, pylon fracture, open pylon fracture, and our orthopedic surgeons are doing like that. What will be the fate? At least you can do something by the Elizabeth. Deprive all the bad things, all the sequestrated things, and putting the Elizabeth in such a way, and corticotomy, while there is a bone loss, no problem. The radius Allah. It is also the problematic and the complicated case in the field of Elijah of surgeons. And if you know something for the for the radius of Allah and Elijah of method, you can do something help the, to the patient. The patient is very happy. Still, the frame is here and it is United, still, I kept the, uh, kept the Elizabeth frame in his hand, in her hand. So, Elizabeth method is not only for the union, infective non-union or gap non-union in the, in, in, the, in the field of orthopedic branch. It is familiar. We are none from Novikov, none from Gobin, none from Shepchov, none from the great teachers like uh, uh, Professor Seng, Professor Harshad, and many other friends in the country that they are applied the Elizabeth apparatus in, in, in the urology, 
in the nef in in the nef uh, in neurology and other subject also we have a agreement to the kurgan i think the kurgan people are here the rashan people are here professor nobikov is here we have a agreement to the alexander gavin the great teacher and the, now the director of ras and rto and the previous to him professor shepsa was here we have a agreement between the kurgan and the nitor that our junior colleagues or eligible surgeons will go there visited there and also learn something from them so in this eligible day 100 year but the anniversary of eligible day i would like to mention and to recognize uh, remember that days that in future this agreement would be followed by the present administrator now not only the kurgan professor bari sir he has conquered not only the conquered bangladesh he has conquered the world so now the world is in his own hand dr jangir please attend to me now the world is under our hand but there is professor bari india is with us russia with us china with us egypt with us so it's our pleasure and it's our i think it's our as, as, is sir pleasure that professor harshad harshad you are under us you are under professor bari so you are in gurgaon professor nobigov in cheng in thailand mr doctor you are here also so i think hamza sir i do what i want that you understand now the world is under bangladesh in elizarov and under professor honored professor professor bari i salute you sir you. last of all the people the man who is behind the elizarov he is gabriel <coughs> the man behind the elizarov is mentioned he is the philanthropist the philosopher is the great academician and magician of elizarov he is professor gabriel elizarov he is no more in the world we pray to almighty for his eternal peace and the method elizarov apnar jene ka dorkar before his death urgan center kintu naam hoyeche tar pore urgan elizarov so rsc rt এই যে নামটা এলিজাভ এলিজাভ সাহেবের নামটা আফটার ইজ ডেথ দা সেন্টার অফ নেম এস আর আই এস সি এন্ড আর টি ও দ্যাট ইজ উরগান এলিজাভ সেন্টার এলিজাভ এন্ড আর আই এস সি এন্ড আর টি ও সো ইন দিস বার্থ অ্যানিভার্সারি অফ আওয়ার গ্রেট টিচার আওয়ার গ্রেট ইনভেন্টার অফ দি ওয়ার্ল্ড প্রফেসর এলিজাভ i would like to remember you your family and your invention for the homo sapiens in the world and i will i will be very happy if our audience those who are connected with us the great teachers of elizarov and also our disciples you are in front of me and all over the country it was telecasted so those are to be surgeons Elizabeth Sarson sir connected with us please doing help for the people apra duniya to ei din thakben na jao din thakben ei corona te amader oneke ke niye eshe 300 doctors from bangladesh they are going to heaven so you do something for the people so with this few words again i remember professor gabriel elizarov for his tunnel beach and those who are connected from here and there i salute everybody for this uh, great occasion and i also i would like to also bless my thanks to rash tv 
and also the ortho tv in india that they are telecasted all over the country from the television and some journalists are here also i would like to give my thanks and bless my uh, blessings to you also particularly from rash tv dr basudev ji here dr aditi ji here is why so thank you very much for the uh, for the proper for the passion benefit uh, for the passion uh, hearing and you go forward why there is elizarab why there is all the modalities of treatment is here failed then elizarab begins elizarab started with this home message i would conclude my speech thank you very much thank you also and dobre dobre vesar dobre vesar nabikab dobre vesar professor nabikab dobre vesar and for the hasha namaskar samsuruda assalam alaikum thank you waalaikum assalam thank you very much uh, thank you our honorable director sir professor abdul goni mullah sir for his excellent speech now i would like to request dr mohammad mohammad hussain on behalf of skf to say something and to express the word of thanks and definitely i would like to thank skf for sponsoring our program before that i would like to thank Uh, all the national faculties as well as the international faculties who are with us by sharing their knowledges and experiences with us and especially the young elizarov surgeons in bangladesh who spread the love of elizarov all over the bangladesh and a special salute to them as because of by the spreading of love of elizarov we can give the recovery of millions of peoples now i would like to request dr Muhammad Murad Hussain to say a vote of thanks before that i am dr mohammad tanvir ashraf consultant at orthopedics say bye bye to you and assalamu alaikum to all of you uh, thank you very much and assalamu alaikum and a very good afternoon to all of you uh, first of all uh, first of all i would like to express my thanks and gratitude from skip part Uh, to bangladesh orthopedic society assami bangladesh chapter and also to nitor for organizing this wonderful webinar and we are very much pleased to be a part of this seminar and hopefully we'll yeah, in coming days we'll also be a part of uh, bangladesh orthopedic society nitor and also assami bangladesh chapter i just want to uh, mention something about our brands as you know today our uh, brand partner is etoric oxy preparation etorics the super fast pain killer and you are all all aware about the brand our second brand is nabumet that is nabumeton uh, the most renal friendly pain killer in bangladesh and our third brand is naproxen and isomiprazole combination naprox pass so i hope you all are aware of these brands and hopefully in coming days you all will prescribe these brands and definitely escape and our brands will be with you in coming days with all the clinical seminars symposium workshops and trainings thank you thank you very much welcome blue koi Oh, okay, everybody! Thank you for being with us. And now I would like to conclude this program, and uh, I would uh, like to give thanks to all the participants who joined with us. I uh, hope we can uh, arrange this sort of program in future. Uh, till then, I would like to say bye bye and assalamu alaikum to all the participants who joined with us. Bye bye, and that's the end of this program. You are watching Raj TV, Jagorone, Bangladesh. Please subscribe our channel.
Yeah, yeah. Dr. Tanvir, we are uh, offline. Can you hear me now? I have unmuted myself. Yes, yes, sir. I can you hear. Can hear? Huh? Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Directly. Tanvir? Tanvir, why you are... Oh, Tanvir. <laughs> I think he has gone, sir. He was on the stage. We can leave, sir. No, but I am not here, able to hear. It's yeah. very, 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 very... Very difficult, yeah. Yeah. Then we can leave, sir. We can leave. I think they have just uh, no. ending of the. I'm we sure I'm not able to hear you. Can you hear me? Yes, sir, I can hear. So we can leave, sir. I can't hear you clearly. It is very far away. The voice sound. What to do? We can leave, sir. We can leave. Yeah. We okay. Say thanks to all on my behalf then. Yeah. Okay. No, we call service there. Oh, so there are only we four are there, is it? All have left. Yes, sir. Yeah. You can no, leave. No. Jai Hind. Amjad Bhai, how are you? Dr. Hasha, yeah. I have not left. Hello. I am still here. Welcome, welcome back. Hello. I put this white coat. Hello. Professor Shefto gave me this tie. Only Hello. because in Russia, I had seen all of you put a white coat and a tie and a shirt. I thought Constantine is coming. Let me also come the same way. Ah. That's why today, after a long time. How are you, sir? Okay. Okay, Dr. Hasha. <laughs> Dr. Harshan. You can unmute yourself. Dr. Noviko. You can unmute, unmute yourself, please. Yeah, yeah, unmute, unmute yeah. yourself. Yeah, it is unmuted. Oh, Shabdo Okay, okay. Hello. Dr. Harsha. Harsha, sir. Thank you very much. All of you, Bring something. and after the pandemic, we will meet more of them now. Okay. Still, Shamshul, I can't hear. Shamshul, unmute. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay, now five of us are there. Dr. Vikas, me. Amda sir is saying Dr. something to you, sir. Baki ke sab yeah, yeah. Dr. Shamshul, yes, Huda. Ashok Sham ka naam rehta hai, nahi milte. <laughs> Ashok Sham is making live on Auto TV, sir. Yeah. Ah. So what news? No we go. Summertime. Summertime yeah. must be warm in Russia. Kurgan. No, Just that. now, yeah. I think uh, more than India. Uh, tomorrow will 37. Ah. 37. You are in Kurgan oh. or somewhere else? Here, here. In, in Kurgan. 37. Very warm. Really? Very warm. That's warm. Very yeah. Even when we are visiting 11, that time also it was warm. Not we thought that it was it would be very cold. So we took all <laughs> our co clothes. I want to go to Kurgan when ice is there. <laughs> you have then visited that... how many times, Dr. Harsha? In Kurgan? You have Who? visited? Yeah, Dr. Amjad is speaking. Dr. Amjad is speaking. Hello. Hello. Not able yeah. to hear. Sound, your sounds are very, very low. I am not able to hear at all. Oh, huh. but I am talking in full volume. No, your lecture yeah. I heard full, full voice, full sound was there. No, because <laughs> full sound. Uh, yeah, after yeah, mine, yeah. Uh, that thing went down. Yeah, but you, you volume yeah. went down a lot. I am not and able you, to hear at all anything. Mine is hundred percent here. Okay, but it's okay. not increasing. Okay. 
That's great. We are having COVID over here, sure. our people. Yeah. So thank you again. Can you speak a yeah. little loudly. Can you speak a little loudly? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Arshad sir, can you use the my mi yeah, microphone? Maybe you can listen. Microphone I didn't bring, but can you speak loudly? <laughs> loudly. Yeah. We okay. are. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Good day, sir. I don't. Okay, know. sir. Living, sir.